Apple's sales team is worried about how Android is affecting the iPhone's growth. Windows Phone 8.1 improvements get fully detailed, which include developer interaction. And the Obama administration isn't happy at all with Samsung's recent selfie. I'm Jaime Rivera, and given the fact that it's Friday, I don't mind doing selfies with anybody, Samsung, uh, but not for free. This is Pocket Now Daily. Let's start today off with some official news as one thing that has not taken off is wireless charging. And if you think about the fact that you have to buy a separate accessory for something that you already get an accessory for, then it's kind of odd. But Nokia thinks that they should push the way this is going to happen. So they are going to bundle wireless charging ports as of the Lumia 930. You can expect that for free. And hopefully they do that with future flagships and other OEMs do it as well for it to become ubiquitous. Now let's talk about Windows Phone 8.1 as more details emerge as we now learn that, for example, applications will back up their data on OneDrive, which is awesome. That's probably one of the coolest features that's coming. But even cooler is the fact that now developers will be able to respond to your feedback whenever you don't like something in an application. Hopefully that's directly and it doesn't hinder apps. But anyways, we get more details. Links in the description, they are a lot, so I can't mention them on the video. Now let's talk about HTC as very interesting. We get more reports that the company is now working on a new butterfly device, which is the last Verizon Droid that we saw. Uh, really interesting as apparently this phone will not bring an ultra pixel camera. Apparently we're getting a 13 megapixel camera on this phone, which makes you wonder what exactly is HTC doing with giving lower tiered or not so important phones the cameras and then you get the ultra pixel camera that everybody hates on the One M8. Still, we should expect this phone to launch soon though we don't get any details just yet. Links in the description for full details on specs. Now, as the trial of Apple versus Samsung continues, one of the coolest things is that you get internal documentation and emails. And one very interesting one is the Apple sales team manifesting that they were extremely worried about Android, specifically because you get larger displays and expandable storage and a lot of the stuff that you don't get on the iPhone. And according to the sales team, they're extremely worried on the iPhone's performance in the future as the phone has sold better year over year, quarter over quarter, but that doesn't mean that it has hasn't or will not find better competition going forward. So links in the description for the full story on what to expect from this trial as it gets hotter and hotter by the minute. And finally, for the very interesting and dramatic news of the day, the Obama administration seems to be upset over the recent Samsung selfie. That was silently a selfie as a uh, Red Sox player, David Ortiz, or fine, David Ortiz, uh, recently asked President Obama for a selfie as the Red Sox were getting commemorated over the fact that they won the World Series. And uh, President Obama said yes, but eventually he figured out the fact that uh, Ortiz was being sponsored by Samsung. Now, Ortiz denies that Samsung asked him to do the selfie, but still, he got the tweets and everything. But that leads me to the question of the day. What do you think about Samsung's recent marketing with all this selfie thing that happened at the Oscars and now with the Obama picture? Uh, in my particular case, hey, if it'll get them tweets and it'll help them sell phones, then why not? I think it's cool. But anyways, leave us a comment down below and hopefully Samsung will provide better cameras for selfies right? And friends, you know the drill. If you want an earlier scoop of everything that's happening in the smartphone and top world machine, follow us on pocketnow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can also follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We will see you next week.